Greetings and salutations people, this is a guide on how to run Severance Blur Darkness on Windows 10. This is for the installer version 2108, so if you have a different version of the game, this guide might not work. The first step is to activate Direct Play, so we will go down to the search bar, type in optional features.exe, press enter, scroll down to the legacy component, expand and make sure that the Direct Play is enabled, and then click OK to save. Once you have the base game installed, we need to install DG Voodoo 2 fix, so just follow the link in the description, which will lead you to the download section and download the latest stable version. Just click and save. Once you have downloaded and extracted the archive, you can go to the quick guide, which will open up the install instructions. You can follow, or I will show you how I did it for me. And this is something that worked for me, if it doesn't work for you, please go back to this page and follow all the instructions. So first we need to open the installation folder. We can go to the shortcut, right click, open file location. There it is. Now we go back to the extracted archive, open 3dfx86, copy these DLLs, and just place them in this folder. Paste. Replace when asked. Now we go back to the extracted files again, but the ms folder 86 and copy these DLLs. Go back to the installation folder and paste. Now it shouldn't ask you to replace, but since I already have them, I have to replace. That should be it. And for the final step, you never want to run the game through the shortcut, but always right click, go to the installation folder, run as administrator on the application, exe, yes. I will show you which settings to use, always select our OpenGL and Miles Fast 2D Position Audio. You can configure to whatever you want as your resolution, maybe the monitor native. I'll select this for now, OK, and play. And there you have it, how to run Severance Battle of Darkness on Windows 10. Now you can have fun playing, modding, whatever you want, enjoy one of my favorite games, and thank you for watching.